welcome back. My mind is in a million different places and I can't focus. Um, so I'm forcing myself to focus. But one thing that helps me is to um, take an area of my home that is making me the most anxious and picking it up, organizing it, cleaning it. So that's what we're gonna do today. I would much rather do other things. I would love to go shop online. I need to do the budget. All of that kind of stuff I would love to do. Um, but this area, this under the stairs closet is just, it's been, been neglected. Um, just been throwing everything in there. And you guys probably, if you've been here for a while, you know that I just recently, a couple months ago, cleans this out, um, but it's gotten bad again. So that's what I'm gonna work on today. I'm gonna take everything out. Um, it's just our dumping ground for everything. Um, all of like the celebrations and we've had two birthday parties and so all of like that stuff I just dump in here. So um, we are done with birthday parties until, um, well, my son has a birthday party in December, but we normally just do like a family dinner. So the next like big birthday party would be in January. So we have a break of birthday parties. Um, I'm very thankful for. So I'm gonna take this time to get organized and hopefully this will really help my um, anxiety. So we're gonna get going. Does anyone want to take bets on how long this is going to stay clean? Because I can probably tell you it'll probably, it might be about two months where this will stay clean. always amazed at how much stuff is in this closet but it's my own fault I just throw everything in there if I don't know what to do with it I just throw it in there and with the idea that I will go back and put it in the right spot but I normally don't do that and then this jumpsuit it was super cute it's a knockoff to I think it's free people but I got it off of Sheen and the quality just isn't that great. The um, shorts just kept coming up. So you can see me like tugging at it a million different times. I accidentally trapped my dog in a certain area and he was trying to get through. And so that was the reason why he was just in my way. He was trying to get into the main part of the house and not just the laundry room area. So while this is drying a little bit, I'm going to attempt to organize um, some of these so we can just like go ahead and put it in the bins. 
Um, so yeah, let me try to do that. Now that the easy part is done, clearing out the closets, we have to make the hard decisions on what to keep and what to give away. Especially like whenever it comes to like my kids' crafts, I always feel so bad throwing stuff away, but I just, I can't keep everything. Obviously, I don't think anyone can keep everything, um, but it's just kind of, you know, if you're a mom, you kind of, you have to like hide the things that you throw away. Anyways, um, I am just going through the things and categorizing it, what items need to go into a bin. And I had so many boxes that had just a few things in it or nothing at all that I just needed to get rid of. They were just like Amazon purchases. And again, I just threw it in the closet thinking that I would go in there and organize it, which I guess now I am, but it was a little bit longer process than I expected. Okay, you guys, my parents ended up coming over and <laughs> it scared me. I still can't um, film in front of people and, as well. And then they stayed a while. Um, so I finished the project. I want to show you the end result. Um, I ended up, I was getting so hot. I ended up having to like put my hair up and everything, as you can tell. But let me flip this camera around and show you. Okay, so floor is cleared, and then all of this back here, um, I was vacuuming, so I need to add the vacuum. I really want to get rid of this shredder. Um, I found a different one on Amazon that I want to purchase, but my husband doesn't want to <laughs> get rid of that one yet. This is kind of like a hodgepodge, like party stuff, I think. What I'm gonna do, we just, it's like leftover stuff. Like this, I made, had these made for my daughter. Um, let's see, these bags are leftover from my um, son's baseball party. And then I have just the other random stuff in here. And my mom gave me a good idea. She said that next year, whenever they do the garage sale, we can just have things in there of like the miscellaneous stuff and maybe like put a bag together and then sell it as a whole but this is all of like my gift wrapping station um i do need to get more gift wrap i feel like i think i'm missing actually i think the kids took it so i bought all of these containers from the container store i have coloring books workbooks paints uh, we actually went through all the paint and got rid of like the dried up ones. And then this is uh, kids crafts. I need to make a label for that one. Fabric. I really need to go through that because I do not sew anymore. So I need to go through that and probably get rid of a lot of stuff. Um, more kids crafts. Jewelry making. Like my crafts. Balloons. I don't think that we will. <laughs> I am like busting at the seams. Even this is balloons up here. 
Um, I don't think we'll need balloons for a while. Streamers. And then this is just miscellaneous stuff. And then also I have all that up there with stuff too. So it turned out really good. I'm really proud of myself. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.